Grace and Chapel. We're here to celebrate a promise that was made a promise of love 25 years ago between Philip and Leslie. Marriage is two hearts with one love that grows greater through the years and is treasured above all else. Marriage is a promise to communicate and to share, to treat each other with respect, to care and to listen to one another. But marriage is also a commitment between a husband and a wife to be not only each other's lover, but above all, most importantly, Elvis's lover. <laughs> Best friends for all your years together. You two would turn face to face, hold hands, and look into each other's eyes. Place that ring on your wife's finger, Philip. Okay, ready? Look her in your eyes and tell her I take you once again. Ready? I take you once again. To be my loving wife. To be my loving wife. In good times and bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. Sickness and in health. For richer, for poor. For richer, for poor. For now and forever. For now and forever. Ah. <laughs> and as you place that ring on Philip's finger. Tell him, let's say, I take you once again. I take you once again. To be my loving husband. To be my loving husband. In good times and bad. In good times and bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. For richer, for poor. For richer, for poor. For now and forever. For now and forever. You have some vows you like to say? Yes. Mm -hmm. Make you start first. Years. When you asked me to marry you 26 years ago, I knew you were my soulmate. You would always be my soulmate. After one month of asking me to marry you, and one year later, 25 years, said our vows, we still are soulmates to this day because we are the best friends first and remain soulmates. Through thick and thin, richer and poor, in sickness and in health, we will remain soulmates as we did that very first day that we met. I love you, Philip Riggins, and I can't wait to spend 25 more years, 50 more years, to 100 more years to be by your side. I love you. I love you too, I'd like to say. Today I choose to continue to build my life with you. I love everything about you, your humor, your passion for life, your strength in grief and adversity, and your 10,000 times the enthusiasm. You know, life's a roller coaster ride with its ups and downs. I vow to be your best friend to comfort and support you in times of struggle. I'll be here to celebrate and laugh with you in the good times. I vow to be your lover, I, to give you the daily gifts of touch, time, and words of love. I will listen closely to your needs and honestly tell you my own. You know that I'll be faithful to you. 
I will strive to be a person that you can trust and depend on. I will work with you to build our future. I will respect your dreams as much as my own. I want you to know that I love you and I'm here for you today and for all the days of our life together. I honestly feel as if we are best friends. You are my favorite person in this world. I vow to always love you tender and I'll never treat you like a hound dog. Wonderful, guys. We do have some special vows, so tell each other at the same time. I promise. I promise. To take you as my hunk of hunk of burning love. To take, take you, you as, as my hunk of hunk of burning, burning love. love. And always love you tender. Always, always love you tender. tender. And never return you to sender. And never return, return you to sender. I will never step on your blue suede shoes. I'll, I'll never, never step on your blue suede shoes. Or treat you like a hound dog. Or, or treat, treat you like, like a hound dog. dog. For you will always be. For you, you will always be. My loving teddy bear. My, my loving, loving teddy bear. bear. Wonderful, guys. Well, let me just say, may your love always sustain you two in trying times. But make those happy times even more wonderful and fulfilling as the years go by. So on behalf of the grace of one chapel and a suit that I wear, thank you very much. Once again, pronounce you, husband and wife, kiss your wife. Yes, you can help us at Up the Building. Thank you and good afternoon.